Is there anything Gaz can say to Dan as we wrap this one up? Is there anything you know, Gaz would say to? Uh, let's see. Well, he'd definitely say um, thank you for all that you do. We appreciate you being an honorary member of the task force. And uh, I think he'd also say, um, he'd say, remember, you're not dead if you're hanging from a bloody rope. <laughs> so take that with you. <laughs> Huge pops to Elliot for smashing the rollers, Gaz. Good work, soldier. Yeah, that's it. Let's get it done, yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of Rog and a lot of, uh, yes, boss. In fact, <laughs> me, and, me and Barry, um, who's uh, Captain Price, we laugh a lot because um, <laughs> throughout the couple games, especially the first one, it's like Kyle was... Um, I don't know. It's like he was a little his uh, errand runner, which is so funny. It's like his assistant. So whenever oh, we did, I would say that not so much in the game, but in between, whenever yeah. we we're rehearsing, oh, I was okay. all get me a tea, and I'm like, yes, <laughs> constantly. <laughs> I gotta love it. How's that relationship with you and, and Barry unfolded over the years? Because it, it sort of resonates on the screen for me, anyway. The, the camaraderie that you two have just sort of resonates for me. Is that something that's that translated from off to on? Yeah, man. Barry's awesome. Uh, I love him. I'm pretty sure it's mutual too. We have a really good time. We all have a really good time when we get into the studio and we're making the game with the guys and we're back with, with Jeff and with Brian. Um, and uh, I posted a thing earlier. I said, we have a lot more fun than it looks like we do in the game. There's not a lot of room for laughs and smiles in the game. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when we're in there, when we're doing it, we have a blast, man. Everyone loves being a part of it. It's really nice to come back a couple of years later and, you know, bring these characters back to life again and, and bring their new stories to life. Yeah. And yeah, naturally, a lot of Gaz's missions are, are with Price. So I'm working with Barry almost every time I'm in. And uh, it, it's so fun. I can't imagine anyone being a better Price, to be honest. And I, I wouldn't want to do it with anyone else. He's a, it's a good duo. It's a good duo. I'd be happy if we get to keep doing it for a bit. Boss, what the hell are we doing here? What clearing up a mess? With women and children. They were leveraged. They were hostages. When you take the gloves off, you get blood on your hands, Kyle. That's how it works. Where do we draw the line, Essa? You draw the line wherever you need it, Sergeant. At the end of the day, someone has to make the enemy scared of the dark. We get dirty, and the world stays clean. That's the mission. How is it when you when you're going onto YouTube and you type in Gaz voice lines and you just listen to all your lo- all your screaming over and over? Have you done that? Have who you seen does that? that? I don't know who and puts that together. Where do they get together? the footage? Where do they? Get I the have no. From? I can't even get that footage. That it's so top secret, and then it's just out there. Um, yeah, I did for, for the one for the one 2019. I did here. It's like a two hour video of just nonstop. And I can't stand with the voice anyway most of the time, but. Um, you know, because we shoot the game um, for about a year and a half, a couple of years on and off. Um, so every few weeks we'll come in and do, because they, you know, the guys write the game as we go along. Yep. We don't know everything that's going to happen. So it's a long process and we don't remember everything. So to sit and listen to back to back all the work that you did, it blows my mind. I think even, even um, the last time I was in to do some of that stuff, it's, I think it was 1,007 lines, because I remember the 007 part, which you do at least twice all the way through. And that's just for multiplayer, let alone, you know, just doing the campaign scene. So, yeah, it's it's a lot. It's a weird one. It's a, There's a lot about this job that's very weird, but very cool and pretty unique. So, you know, I'll take it. And if you want to see... Elliot's work, guys. I just uploaded a video, all Gaz cutscenes from Modern Warfare 2019 and 2. All right. So you can check it out too, Elliot, if you want. If you want yeah, to see your own work. Check out a bunch of your stuff. You kidding? <laughs> I'm in. I'm hitting subscribe. I'm ready. Oh, thank you, mate. Hey, what yeah. about, what, what about like with, with the voices? Because you're surrounded by Captain Price, you're surrounded by Ghost, all these guys with these big, thick accents. And then, 
how, how does that work? How do you work around that? It's funny. It's one of the things that we laugh about in there because, you know, <laughs> I mean, Barry Scouse and doesn't sound anything like Price. Yeah. Chloe is Aussie and we're all just our energy so different when we're in there. Um, you know, it's part of what the fun is. Um, but for me, it's, you know, I think there's a fine line and Barry's made a good point of saying this too and we've chatted about it. It's not yeah. about going in and sounding tough and much like that's not the point of it. Yeah. And a lot of the time when you talk to these guys who are actually out there in the field, it's not about how anything looks or how anything sounds. Everyone isn't walking around jacked and can lift a car. You know, it's not about that. It's about like what's up here is what makes yeah. the team. That's what makes one for one. Um, so with that, for Gaz, the voice I see is like a progression in the same way. In, uh, in MW2 this year, it was cool to find more moments when Gaz in his voice, like he settles down in himself. He's not all the time, but he's a little more relaxed, a little drawn back, a little lower, more grounded, a little deeper, a little thicker, because he's feeling more in control of what he's doing. He's learning. Yeah, I did notice that. Yeah. I, yeah, I'm slight, glad, dude. Slight nuance to to the performance, because I played the first one yeah. just just before the second. I did sure. notice that. Uh, oh, yeah. Elliot, what was it like working with Brian Bloom? That's from Graves Plays. Legend, legend, <laughs> cover him in gold, make a statue. Terrible, uh, terrible writer. I mean, oh, awful. <laughs> <laughs> the worst. Brian yeah. is amazing. He's like, he's the pulse of the franchise, you know, at least mm. that's how I, I think of him. He's always there with us when we're in, so passionate, yeah. so intelligent about what he's doing. And I've got to say, they care so much. And it's it's such an honor to be a part of any project where the people at the helm of the storytelling care passionately about the detail and the history and the future of the story that you're telling. Um, I don't know how he does it, honestly, but you know, phenomenal writer, phenomenal actor, the most incredible voice I've ever heard. Uh, he's voiced so many things, so many games and animations. Well, that's the thing. And he he's He's done a COD game. He's been a main character. So that must help you yep. guys as well. Because he's oh, been yeah, in he's your shoes. Cool, yeah. He really, he's the of it, man. He he knows we have any questions, he always has the answer or really helpful information. And I think it's important, like, we want to do the story justice and, uh, you know, the this isn't based on anything real, but for everything that is believable and, you know, a unique detail about the world that we're portraying, he's always there to help make sure that we do it right. Mm. Um yeah, he's really amazing. I'm so happy that he's uh, that he's on board and he, uh, you know, that he wrote this one to success again. I'm really, I'm really proud of him and pleased for those guys. And he's doing the future stuff too, or you can't say. I I don't. That's above my pay grade. Okay. I can only hope oh, so. Yeah. Okay. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't see yeah. why not. I yeah, can I only imagine he'd be too busy. But he loves this <laughs> so much. So hopefully he's not. Hopefully he's a. And and shout out to. You.